If you've been trying to get rid of primitive reflexes for months or years, and you've been doing exercises consistently over and over and over again, and you're not getting rid of them, here's what you're missing. And here's the thing, it's not that you're not trying hard enough or, or even doing the right things, because a lot of times people are doing the right activities. We're just missing this piece right here. And I'm gonna tell you a story. I had a patient that came to me that had been working on these reflexes for three years. Went to MNRI camps, went to all these different things, tried to get rid of them for years and years and years. The only thing that I did to start was take gluten out of his diet. And within two weeks, his reflexes were like 90% better. What it does mean is that if we still have retained reflexes, it simply means that our brain isn't functioning well enough to inhibit them in the first place. And because our brain should develop, our frontal lobe should develop, we have frontal striatal pathways that come down and regulate and shut down these reflexes. Well, if our brain's too inflamed because maybe we're eating a food or exposed to a toxin or we have lack of mitochondrial function, our brain can't inhibit these reflexes. It's not because we're doing so much exercise that we're you know, integrating the reflex, it's we're getting their brain the information, the stimulus, and the most importantly, the energy it needs to start to develop, get those frontal lobes to fire, then their brain inhibits those reflexes, their movement patterns open up, and they start to develop. So does this mean that you need to take gluten out of every kid's diet to get rid of the reflexes? Absolutely not. But what it does mean is that the way you initially learned it of you have to do these exercises over and over and over again to get rid of these reflexes is false. And when we address the underlying mechanisms, we can get rid of these reflexes often without ever doing exercises in the first place. Seek the help of someone that can get rid of them really quickly and understands this information because it'll make a world of difference. Instead of taking six months, 18 months, three years to get rid of these reflexes, you can get rid of them much quicker and move on to the next developmental sequence that needs to be worked on. Hope this helps you guys out. If you need help, DM me help and my staff will reach out to you and we can chat more. Have an awesome day.